Hi everybody, welcome to formerly Reverse the Verse Live, now Star Citizen Live. Uh, I'm your host, uh, Jared Huckabee, and uh, it's, still the, uh, it's still the same show uh, uh, you know and are probably somewhat fond of, hopefully, maybe. I was going to say love, but I didn't want to assume. Uh, each week we come back, we got interviews, we got game dev, we learn how to make things. Uh, today, we are actually uh, playing the game. Uh, we are playing the game today because we have uh, two esteemed uh, uh, guests with us today, and we thought we could do something that we've never actually done. Uh, joining us on the show are uh, Luke Presley and uh, Gareth Bourne from uh, the UK. How are you guys doing, guys? Great, thanks, Jared. Yeah, having a, having a great time so far. Now, you are some of the mission designers that work on missions for all of Alpha 3, uh, for Star Citizen Live, uh, but specifically, uh, you worked on the mission that we're going to be playing today uh, from Tisha Pacheco, correct? Yeah, that's correct. Yep, Gareth uh, made that one. Yep, the orders that be came from Luke, and I went off, and you ended up with what you're about to see. <laughs> so, so we are. We are Fingers crossed, it's good, Gary. Yeah. <laughs> so we are here. We are here in game, and we're actually joined by uh, three uh, Star Citizen uh, streamers uh, who who were who were chosen throughout the week to join us today. Uh, we've got uh, the Detox. Uh, say hi, Detox. Hello. You're supposed. You were supposed to say hi, Detox. Hi, Detox. <laughs> I set you up for it. Uh, we've got Uber Nerd. How you doing, Uber? I'm doing all right. Hello, everyone. Now, Uber Nerd shows up on my screen as uh, Rocket Rob, uh, so you can tell who, who that is when we go through. And then finally, last but not least, uh, Nerd Show and Tell. Nerd, how you doing, man? I'm doing pretty good. How you doing? <laughs> uh, I'm doing well. It's, 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 it's bright and early here today, although you wouldn't know it from my lighting here. Uh, but uh, yeah, we are we are going to play through the t-shirt, the, the one of the t-shirt Pacheco missions. We'll see which ones uh, we get. Um, Luke, why don't you go ahead and, and, and start us off? Tell us t tell us where these things start from. Where does where does a mission start from while we while we head over there? We're at the we're at the starport now. We're gonna go take the tram. Let's go take the tram. Okay, Jared. Uh, you're gonna turn chat off. Okay, <laughs> turn what? Uh, oh. Chat. Chat. There we go. Sorry, we're triggering me. <laughs> um, this is going so great. So where do missions start from? <laughs> okay. Uh, um, so, uh, when we come to plan for a release, um, we uh, like we, we may have a mission giver for a start, um, or we'll have a new location, um, and that obviously uh, in, entails us coming up with a, a mission for them, or a mission that f suits the law of that location. Mm -hmm. um, Tisha Pacheco, in this case, um, and... Uh, well, we decided to reuse the underground facility for um, for that lo a location because we thought, you know, um, we hadn't really taken them to, like, we hadn't used yeah. them enough. Basically. Yeah, it was nice to make another variant of them. Yeah, and we're putting more effort into those as well as we speak, actually, we oh, making yeah. some more entrances into them. Um, yeah, so um, we we get the um, like requirements, like you need to make a, a mission for Tisha Pacheco. Uh, we get the law for Tisha Pacheco. You know, she's a who she uh, is, what she does. Yeah, let me see. Uh, she's. Oh, let me try and remember. Um, she is. She works for the Antari, Antari Company, which is like this kind of cartel, but is also a, a shady business, I think, as well. And they're trying to move into the, uh, Stanton, push out all the other, um, the other competitors. Um, like just obviously drugs is just one yeah. part of the criminal yeah empire um so uh yeah like and, and but, but trying to be clever with it as well so we went down like a path first which what we we oh and also we we, all, we always when it comes to like mission givers there's an excuse to um really experiment and try and do something new um and the thing we tried to do new in this mission was to like gift the player a ship yeah. now um in the future we want to properly like gift them for the duration of missions so they go and use all the systems that they currently are used to like go to an asop terminal uh, and they'll find it gifted in there and then we use all those systems yeah, it's a great opportunity to go all out because you want the mission givers to feel special 
Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, yeah, you know, we get a little extra support on these guys, so it's like we, we you know, try and um, do something different. Um, so, uh, yeah, so in this case, another thing we wanted to do is give them a ship. Um, so we fought up a mission, like, where what they wanted you to do was steer, like, they got the ship um, that was, uh, say, from the Nine Tails. Mm -hmm. um, they'd stolen a ship from the Nine Tails, and they wanted you to. Uh, take that to one of Klim, who's another mission giver, uh, like uh, his, and he's a drug dealer. So you've got the Nine Tails and Klim, who are like uh, at odds uh, competitors in the drug trade, and kind of frame what each other, you know, frame frame the Nine Tails or kind of start a small turf war between these two while the Ontari company kind of moves in over the top. They, we want, really wanted to sell that these guys are not like scrapping on the street yeah really sort like, of a cartel feel behind the behind closed doors yeah um but unfortunately that would have needed several things that we didn't have like um um it was i, I forget now what exactly what the yeah, issue was there things. but um that didn't pan out unfortunately but so we 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 then, we then thought what, what can we do like that allows them to have this ship um and um use all these um like these drug packages we found because we also realized that um criminals or like you know the un unlawful as it were didn't have enough to do when it came to trading um there was literally just i think widow um maybe one i think two. it was widow yeah uh, that they had widow. like to, yeah <laughs> to trade so so i'd, I'd like gone like we need we need more we need all these other drugs so we'd put some effort into those we'd got made to be destructible because I, I you know had an idea we might use it like this i didn't ever think we'd use it to this extreme like when i was asking for those for those assets but um <laughs> I, yeah <laughs> you're like put some drugs in here and then you came to my screen you're like that's a lot of drugs yeah like it, it turns out you need a lot of drugs if you want to hide one package in there but uh, yeah so this is uh, uh check out Pacheco? I, I never know if I'm saying that well, right. I Twitch. think the Americans like to say Pacheco, didn't they? Pacheco. Well, it, it's like an Idris, Idris thing. It, it's one, one of the things yeah. that's, you know, uh, we ask this question of the writers often, and they're, they're, they're reluctant to provide an official pronunciation because one of the things, one of the ways we can make the Star Citizen universe just like the real universe is that there are different regional pronunciations of everybody's name. And, you know, when you span a galaxy, who knows what the original actual pronunciation was? Maybe that individual person does. I think I missed my cue. Yeah. Oh, she, she got impatient. Yeah. yeah, I was, I was, I was stuck. Now, how, is there a way for me to get her to talk to me again? Or do I just, you just walk wait? away. To walk away and come back again. Yeah. Now I've, I've, yeah, I've give actually, it a few seconds. Now one of the reasons we've invited Detox and uh, Show and Tell and uh, Uber here is because I actually haven't ha had the opportunity in this last quarter to play this mission before. So this, so we are actually seeing the first time I've done this mission. So, and I get to do it with uh, uh, pseudo director's commentary with uh, <laughs> uh, uh, Gareth and uh, Luke here. Yeah, we got you back. You bet. Hopefully. She didn't have one for you. She didn't have one for me? You want somebody else want to try? Oh, you've not accepted the oh, mission. Yeah. There's no mission up in the top uh, there. The, have you got an invite? You have to accept the invite. Wait, okay, where am I going? Oh, there it is. I'm looking for work. No, no, no. Uh, you have to accept. Oh, well, if you actually, if you have the invite, she'll automatically give it you. Anyway. Yeah, so it would look like. I don't know if you, you have the, uh, the the mission in that case. It'll be under your personal tab. Troubleshooting as well. Yeah. That's what we're here for. But Spielberg never had to do yeah, You don't have any appointments. I don't have it. No. No. How about any of our guests? Do you guys have it? I didn't take it. Uh, let me take a look. Uh, yes, I do. All right. Shall I progress? Go ahead. That's good. We meet That's again. Dark. You can take the, uh, the counter mission. <laughs> Screw we up. meet again. <laughs> now we'll, we'll, we'll go together. We'll go together. All right, so now Detox is taking the mission. Now he's talking to Pacheco. 
So talk to me about how that system works, Luke. Why, 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 did, why did that function that way? Why did he have it and I didn't? Okay. Um, well, certain missions have certain prerequisites. Um, we, uh, when we first got given that ability, we kind of really went for it. Um, and uh, a bit too hard. Yeah, we realized it's far too early. We really want players to be, if there's little content, we want them to get as much of it as possible. Um, so uh, we, and, and obviously we want them testing. We don't want missions that no one ever sees because they never, you know, and we wipe so often, obviously, that, um, you know, to build your way up to those um, could be quite difficult in that time. Um, so these prerequisites are really just a virtue and reliability. Um, virtue is um, you can you can knock down by doing um, just by killing people basically and, uh, or by doing um, bad missions being naughty yeah um, whereas making it go up is a lot more difficult because you have to kind of um, uh, do missions that you can't it's very I, I guess video games are bad for this but you, it's hard to do good things and be <laughs> rewarded for those like you know it's really easy to go around slapping people just or like real life yeah exactly <laughs> like um, um, so anyway yeah uh, yeah, um, for this particular one, um, we've been, you know, fairly uh, generous, and um, we allow you to accept this mission, uh, like all the way down to extremely bad, and kind of up to like point one. Um, positive good. point one, good. Yeah, positive so point like, one. And uh, uh, yeah. All right. Yeah, so when you start, on, when you start in a server and in a, in a, you know, like after a wipe or whatever you start at zero and you, you can do one tiny decent good thing and still be okay uh no you can do a few i okay. mean like uh, it's a kind of sliding it's a exponential kind of it's a curve so it's as in real life it's a lot hard right if you are a bad guy and you're known for being a bad guy if you do something bad it really doesn't make much of a dent like because you are known for being that bad but if you do something good so, like, if you, well, you know, if you uh, rat on someone, like, suddenly, like, you're way back at the start, like, they don't think you're bad anymore. Um, and it's the same if you're good. If you're, you're extremely virtuous and you do something, you'll fall, fall from grace and, like, you know, yeah. um, fall back to zero. So it's, it's, it's like that. It's... <laughs> Get it in. Ooh, nice. Yeah, the, the, the more good you are, the harder it is to get good at the... <laughs> Yeah, and yeah. yeah, and vice versa. Yeah, um, well, congratulations, Giant. Detox. You're now captain of this mission. Oh <laughs> boy. Well, I th think uh, Show and Tell has happily volunteered to fly at least. So that pressure's oh, yeah. off me. Sure. <laughs> you you call the ball. You 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 pick the missions. So, yeah, you were able to get the mission, so I'm happy ceding command to you. So you make the you make the calls. And now I'll be the that? muscle, Doc. <laughs> Yes. This is this is the time of the show where we uh, where we give the uh, uh, qualifier that Uber Nerd tends to do a lot of voices. If you've ever seen Uber Nerd stream, you'll you'll notice you'll know that he are, he does quite a few voices, and that was one of them. Probably what? not the last one we're going to see or hear. As long as he keeps an hour inside the bunker, we don't want to give away our position. Yep. Got it. You're gonna have to stay frosty. Yes. I will admit that the first time I came to Arcorp, I just rode this tram, like, for 40 minutes. Did you want to, or was that...? Yeah, 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 I, I did. <laughs> yeah. I right, you now, put it now, back and forth, right? Yeah, now, I'm, I'm How seeing, do we get I'm, off? Now, I'm seeing contract availables. Are, the, are those the uh, counter missions? No, no, no. no. Those that... other ones. Well, talk to us about the counter mission. We're not going to take one today, because we're all working together, but how do the counter missions work? Um, well, the idea is that um, it's what we don't want to do is build this like location and all these assets and everything like that just for one mission. Um, and we also want to really bring players together as much as possible um, because obviously it's an entire galaxy. Um, so <laughs> trying to get people to meet, it, they'll think it's empty basically if they don't meet someone quite often. So we yeah. try and. Um, um, kind of concoct reasons for them to, to come across each other. Um, in the previous mission, we tr um, we made um, and Gareth made uh, yeah, the, the Clovis, Clovis mission. Um, we pit you basically directly against each other. 
Um, so one one person has to steal a um, chip from a down satellite and then go and rip it at a. Um... Yeah, it was very much see the guy shoot the guy. Yeah, exactly. Like while the others chase it, um, and so that's fine. But you know, some players don't like the direct PvP. Um, so on this one, we decided that um, we would have it so that okay, they're taken to the same, they're guided to the same location, but they're not necessarily there to you know take out each other. They they, they just happen to be in the same place doing conflicting. Yeah, things. A slight conflict of interest. Yeah. So um, the mission that Detox is playing right now, um, you're out to get um, one very specific item um, box of. Uh, particular drugs for um, Pacheco, um, uh, and it's maize. It's, it's this. Um, it's a very mm. rare. Um, yeah, it's not that. Um, it's a very rare um, drug that's <laughs> worth a lot of money. Um, uh, it's some kind of kind of Jian. Jian. I might be getting my drugs mi mixed John. up. John, you're thinking of slam. No, I'm I'm thinking like there's also um, there's also some kind of drug that is the other alien race. I, uh, God damn, forget. I can't remember which. Maze, I think anyway, Maze is. To, yeah, Tavarin. Yeah, no, you're right. It's Tavarin. I yeah. think Maze is Tavarin. Um, and it's kind of this this thing they use like um, I guess like the um, Native American peace pipe kind of thing. Like they use yeah. it in ceremonies. Mm -hmm. um, but it's it's very rare. Um, and a small amount of it can make a lot of drugs, I guess, like LSD. Yeah, I kind think of LSD. Thing. Yeah, um, you 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 know you need a small volume, but you you get that, and it's worth a lot of money. Um, so she's sending you out for this thing because she's heard that um, uh, through her contacts, like obviously the Antari company have a few uh, security on the payroll, and they have um, they've got wind that they're gonna. Um, that security forces are going to attack and uh, do a drug raid basically on um, a competitor and what she's trying to get you to do is to get there before this goes down and steal this one particular item um, so you are sent there uh, to basically wade through 300 boxes and try and find <laughs> the one in particular that uh, has been very kind of vaguely described to you um, and bring it back to her, mm -hmm. um, which sounds straightforward. Obviously, you get there, and there's uh, going to be some some uh, people to fight. Maybe, hopefully, um, there'll be turrets and stuff like that. Because this is this is obviously a working drug lab. At the time you're arriving, the bust hasn't happened yet. Um, so where the counter mission comes in is uh, we could have just done that mission, and and that be it. Um, but we wanted to inject some tension, some possible tension, into um, the mission because um, we also tell you in that um, the, the description that you know you can seal anything else you, you want while you're there. We don't care. Uh, Pacheco doesn't care. She just wants the box. Um, you know that's all she cares about. Um, you can seal the rest. So there's plenty of opportunity to be greedy, and that's a great. I, like in a game like that's a fantastic idea that you can uh, get greedy and maybe if you get too greedy bad things will happen um so we're here uh, to just, ensure uh, sorry to interrupt we're going to need uh <laughs> right. and tell yeah, to it. request <laughs> exit please thank you very much i did Door is open. yeah man i'm being quiet we, we, we've got we've got mission designer commentary going on here so i i am i am along for the ride Literally on this one. <laughs> uh, it might be a short ride by the looks of it. He's stuck. We're okay. It's okay. Don't worry. I'm panic, people. Got a bad feeling about this. We've got it under control. We've got it under control. It's okay. Can we F4 and look outside? Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting nervous. Hey, okay. Yeah, it's open. Yeah, you're almost tail is there. It's okay. For the for the record, I'm not flying. <laughs> it's all my pilot's drunk. Got a Valkyrie by the tail. Okay, yeah, we're stuck. Is this like a? <laughs> did they give us like? Did they give us a gray cat hanger here? Just full throttle as fast as you can. It's okay. It's okay. Oh god, got I'm it. Doing it. 
Oh no. We're not doing this no, live. There we go. <laughs> there we go. It's okay, it's okay. Gently. Ah, oh, there we go. That is tight. I mean, that's... <laughs> He's fanning the shit around, okay. I believe. Okay. Hey, what's the opposite of F's in chat? What's the opposite of F's in chat? Let's, 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 get, let's get some of those in for nerd show and tell. 45 the other way. Uh, I would not do that. Oh, God. Oh, no. Saved. Oh, no. There we go. That's let's get some saves in chat. That isn't how you fly up. It's, no, you... it's not. I was not prepared to fly today. <laughs> Why did you accept the flight? Was... You got, you got in you the chair. Oh. <laughs> Baseball. Uh, I believe it. There we are. Come on, just hold the space bar down and go up. I feel like my, my character in this position <laughs> you, you would be can't, very you nervous can't, right now. You yeah. can't go up like that. You have to there just space bar and go up until you get to about 2,000 meters and then... Uh, I'm flying with mouse and keyboard. This is terrible. You right. Can, you want to get out of the chair. I can take it. I'm used to, <laughs> I'm used to hot test and I haven't got it plugged in. Oh, boy. Would Sorry, you guys. You want to go to the pilots? We can switch. Why don't we go ahead and switch pilots? Let's do it. Yep. I'm ready. Let me just it. make sure we're clear so we don't. Alright, so while that's going on, we can okay, go on. Okay, ready to go. Flight. Yeah, let's, uh, let's, go. let's make detox look good. Um, yeah, in the mission, in the mission, Pacheco actually drugs the pilot of the ship. Um, <laughs> so, this is normal. <laughs> this is expected. <laughs> <laughs> you shouldn't feel bad, these <laughs> I feel like maybe you're off script here a little bit. Believe it or not. All right. So, um, the, um, how many how uh, many different mission. mission variants does Pacheco have? She got she has four different missions, right? No, no. Actually, she only has one. It's like uh, the, the issue there is, um, well, obviously time and uh, resources. Um, yeah. Okay. But what we do, what the what the idea is, is we could either go down the route, uh, like we used to. Um, when uh, uh, at the very start we give everyone like lots of very generic missions mm -hmm. and I don't want to do that um, I want to focus on uh, every mission giver having their own one interesting mission to start with um, and then as we build more like you know the moment you can actually um, we can gift a ship like the next plan is that we make a return to Bataglia and um, make give her a mining mission uh, where she lends you a ship so that people can who don't have those ships can have a go. You know, there's, there's a whole world. Yeah, there's a whole there. gameplay. Yeah, exactly. But you know, a lot of players aren't the yeah. Detox has to fly because he has the waypoint. <laughs> yeah, I'm on it. Just keep going. Uh, let me give you some directions. Okay, you want to give me direction? Okay, it'll be right. You, you just tell me where to go, Cap. It's, All right. It'll be very easy, like 14 kilometers out. That's why I took the flight, but I yeah. realized my hot test wasn't ready to rock. Let's which is the one thing I probably should have checked today, so... Nine degrees to the right. I'll keep going, you tell me when to stop. And stop. And straight ahead, head for those beautiful buildings right. there on the horizon. I've also got your landing gear down. Yep. Good deal. Showing off a nice animation there. Docker's a good looking ship. Yes. Yeah, it's pretty. Yeah, it's my favorite ship in the game right now in terms of just its overall aesthetic. Is this the Liberator variant? Yes. Yep. Actually, I haven't been in it in person. The Liberator one. Yeah, this is the copper-colored one. I, I like the colors. Seems more like a, you know, a, like an Admiral-esque ship or something. Only, only the best for Jeff. I know, right? <laughs> no, I am unable to just rain fire down on innocent people, right? Yeah. Uh, for yet. a little while, you'll <laughs> soon clear the green zone. All right. Um, 30 degrees, you're right, nerd. And keep going. So what we're looking for here is the, um, the rooftop that um, Pacheco sent you to to collect the ship that she's landing in. And we did that because some players don't have ships that can put cargo in them at right. all. So, um, you know, it, it, you're here to carry one box, perhaps get greedy. Um, so we yeah. give you a cutlass. Yeah, it gives you a ship with plenty of space to uh, risk your skin for more boxes. Yeah. 
No, yeah. You should just see a cutlass there parked up on the landing pad to your right. It's about 90 degrees to your right now. And, uh, um, straight ahead, there's a landing pad beyond uh, to your left. 20 degrees left. Halt. Okay. Straight ahead. Yeah. There it is. You got it. Now you, and uh, yeah. You mentioned the uh, when you were describing the when you were describing the the missions and why you create them. Uh, lots of times, there are you know the re restriction when you make a mission. There's the restrictions of what tech is online, what tools are online for you, for you to work with, and then other times like this one, like you added the the, the, the ship lending as as a way to you know kind of push uh, the development of new of new systems. Yes. Yep. Um, the way the ship landing, uh, ship lending is done at the moment is very hacky. Uh, yes, and Gareth we've done some some sneaky things. Some bad things. Because um, obviously, what what we'd really like is the ability to use the systems that already exist. Like all players are used to being able to unlock their own ship and then have all their party members. Yeah, hook it up to all your friends and probably them. Yeah, we? exactly. Um, we haven't been able to do that for this, um, which is why, obviously, the, the work needs to be done to a properly le uh, like loan new uh, ships by the ASOP terminal on that. Where, where, um, where's the exit for this trip? I don't, know. I don't know. Can you just hold? Is it you? Is it Y now? It's Y, y now. It's Y now. Y. Yeah, all right. Just, just make sure you, you're not in a, a fighter with a uh, nope. eject seat. I can't get out. There we go. Oh, there you go. Yeah, so basically this does not work um, like you'd expect <laughs> yes. uh, um, any other ship to work. And that's not the intention. Um, that's step one. It's like a proof of concept. Exactly. This is our prototype, really. Because, again, we're, we're an alpha game and... Yeah, you uh, have to start somewhere. Yeah, we, we prototype if it's fun, if it works, yeah, we'll make it properly. Yep. Yeah. Do, do I still have my? Do I still have my uh, bear? <gasps> I lost the bear. No. Sorry. Did you drop? Did you drop him? No, nah, when I got into the turret. That would be stuck on your foot, I imagine. <laughs> it's bad luck. Are we going to talk about the rooftops? Do it. Oh, the rooftops. Yeah. Right. yeah. And how you can go? How Ed is. Doing... Oh, right. Uh, currently, right now, um, Ed, our um, an colleague, is doing a, um, a rework of, of um, these, or maybe maybe not a rework, but uh, remaking or making a new location, uh, which I guess we won't go into. Um, but there's going to be a new blackjack security um, rooftop that has you know fps um and and such on it and it's looking quite interesting yeah um we, we were very lucky to get these you were, um, yes yeah because obviously they the art team had a um all of this uh, planet that is a, a city that yeah they had, all, they had a hard you know, to make which is hard enough yeah <laughs> um and uh, so we were very lucky to get as many of these as we did um but uh, obviously they aren't up to like FPS scrutiny when you get close to them, but um, we are going to be continuing to to evolve these. Nope. No. No. He got into a very old <laughs> Oh yeah. Let's go fall we, down. Go you boom. can rebuild him. Uh. Oh no. I did a bad thing. I tried to look under the thing. It's all right. Oh yeah, you can't. Uh... We can... No, no, uh, go, 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 to, go to the... We can get you. Nope. It's all good. Yeah, let's see. Come get him. How are you going to come get me? Uh, well... Oh my gosh, wake up. that. <laughs> Why don't we... Where, where is your next location? Where Where does the mission want you to go? We'll be going Lyria. to Lyria now, so... Lyria. Okay, why don't um, I just meet you on Lyria? Yeah, you can do. Yeah, go ahead. Go okay. We'll cruise there, and we'll uh, we'll take our time. We'll take our sweet time, and uh, we could always meet you yeah. mid in space and, and EVA across, and you can come board the ship. Sure, let's do that. That's that's pretty safe. So we can wait. Actually, let's uh, actually let, let me let me let me cheat. Hold on, I think I have a cheat. 
think I have GM powers. You do. <gasps> crash, crash. <laughs> I had GM powers. No. I had GM powers. <laughs> oh, with great power <laughs> comes great risk. <laughs> Play me off, that, Johnny. That would have been cool, like showing off all the little cheats that we had. Yeah. But yeah. It's not to be. It's all right. Um, go, go ahead and continue Deliria. I'll get there. See, Roger that. This, I'm wait. this is why uh, missions come off looking bad. <laughs> <laughs> it's not because my fault. It, a, mission, a mission is built out of every other system. It is indeed. Yeah. So all you need is for uh, boxes to fall through floors and uh, and this kind of stuff, and you've got a mission that doesn't work. It's raw. It's honest. Okay. Okay. So so at this point, when you pick up the cutlass, not does every version of this mission send you to Lyria, or are there uh, alternate options? Um, there are alternate. You, Underground facilities, but they're all on Lyria right now. Okay. I so think it, it, it picks three right. of them. Yeah. It may be three of them. I mean, I think there's actually only two varieties of them, sadly. We need to um, uh, get, you know, uh, the procedural um, tools that we have. Um, we got two of them, I think, made yes. um, with this. So ah. there's like an upstairs and a downstairs version. I don't know if you've seen that, like, but we could have many more versions of this. I mean, beyond the upstairs and downstairs, there's not going to be that great uh, an amount of variation on there, but yeah. where certain rooms are, where you come into it, which direction. There will um, be more. Yeah. Uh, so, so. D Detox, Uber, Show and Tell, you guys have any questions for Luke or Gareth? Sure. Yeah, I mean, uh, um, go ahead, Detox. Actually, well, I don't know, you may have mentioned it before. What kind of. How early would you call this mission in its development? Is it like, would it be classes like tier zero, tier one, um, tier two, or um, if you even class them in as such? But um, so... we don't tend to class missions like that. I mean, this this is like ready for a release. Obviously, we've been talking about the fact that mm -hmm. um, the ship is not lent to you in the correct way. Um, we'll have obviously have to go back and address that. Mm -hmm. um the, the rooftops themselves may get some you know maybe that's not classed as the mission but i i i tend to class it as that the rooftops may get some more love the U ugfs will get some more love and many more varieties um it's it i, I we don't tend to really um tier missions in that way because it's it's, it's quite... like i said it relies on so many other things it's hard to yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, missions are always a work in progress. All, all of them are. Um, right. The amount of times we've, uh, like, back in the uh, Star Citizen 2.0 days when these all went in and were um, built in Flowgraph, you know, so like the Tessa Bannister missions and the um, security guard at Korea and, like, you know, there's missions, uh, the all the bounty hunting missions, PvP and stuff like that, they were all built in uh, Flowgraph, and then when it came to turn them into Subsumption, we had to cut a few, or you know, you know, just obviously focus again on the, the ones that gave us the most bang for buck. Um, so, like, I, I'm obviously Subsumption's here to stay. Thankfully, yes. we won't be doing anything like that again. But you know, a huge, a huge thing could change in in the tech that means that. Uh, uh, we have to rethink them or rewrite them or something like that. So I'm, I'm never gonna say that anything's done until, like the game's done. Yeah, that's always. Okay. I'm, I'm, there... I'm the type of person that always push to keep things growing. Is there gonna be like dynamic missions generated between more bespoke ones for mission givers? Um. Well, yeah. I mean, when we we get. We, uh, Tony's working on the dynamic mission system, which is more about um, making different things happen in between. Like we we build the content. Like these are all the possibilities that could happen, and we kind of flow graph that. Not using flow graph, sorry. Stitch it together in a way that says this could happen here, fifty percent chance, or you know whatever. Um, so you could be double crossed, or you could be that, that kind of thing. Um, so um, we we can start going back and giving like all the mission givers more uh, 
well, you might think of more generic missions, but that send you to more interesting locations or have a much higher chance of something interesting happening on the way. So it's not just a straight delivery or something like that. We, we will be able to do that. But um, for now, we we focus on bespoke because what we're trying to do is build up our um, toolbox almost. Yeah. 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 Yeah, so like you know, we take we take this as I was saying you've, about. You've, you've, sorry, I hate to drop, but it's LTA. Yeah, uh, did that not work? Nope, didn't work. Go go off again. Uh, so you need to put go to at the front. So go back to the end. Go all the way to the all end. To the start. All the way to the start. All the way to the start. Yeah. Type go to again, and then, and then the space. space. Yeah. Like that. There you go. Yeah. Ah. So you have to put the put the C bar, the command in for the oh, shot. Shot. Shot turrets. That's turrets. Oh god. Straight back <laughs> to the bed. <laughs> Dead again. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. So where sorry, where yeah. are you guys at? Just on our way to uh to Lyria now. I'm already yeah. at Lyria. Yeah, we're just on <laughs> just in a bit. So I mean for the most part, th this is how we play the game. Like yeah. we, we like we cannot spend the time that right. uh, Defox is now flying to the location. Um, yeah. so I always do that. So looking at full this, playthrough towards the end. And looking at this current mission, uh, what would be like? I know there's a lot of people out there who want to play the mission. What's the best process to get into get this mission uh, from, from Twitch? Um, at this point, so she she should have, and it's kind of strange that she didn't like offer all of you this job right now, but maybe she offers them out one at a time. Um, uh, like, you know, there's one running at the moment, one's accepted, then she'll offer the next one. Um, she's got four to offer, and for that, that number comes basically from, like, we don't want literally everyone, every person on the server to get this mission because then there'd be no one to play the counter mission or you know right. such um and also obviously uh, there's a, a number of locations we can put down like there's no limit to the number of locations but it, every one we add we have to maintain yes. um there's actually a bug in right now oh have you moved it you've moved it right so there was, there was a bug where not, not in this one he's oh right okay so one of the ugfs and it may be this one so get ready for this yeah I'm looking. um it has uh, no collision on its terrain outside. <laughs> I'm an excellent pilot. One, on a, one, it's a, like one in four chance, but you it's, will. It's the one got. called elsewhere. Yeah. Um, so detox to check your uh, description and so, tell me if it says elsewhere. Uh, Roger that. Uh. In the mission mission description, is yep. that in the in the end? Uh, it will just be the name of the location you're going to. Yeah, let's have a look. Some of our competition over at the pit is about to run into some the massive load. Uh, the, 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 the pit yeah. is safe. Yeah. Okay. Is, there the a, is there a certain crime stat you need to, nope. that you should aim for? Okay. No, 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 no. Um, it used to be the case that um, a crime stat would actually impede more missions like especially like the higher crime stats because why would anyone even a criminal hire someone who is being actively hunted um by you know bounty hunters oh my we could stop again. <laughs> I blew up. keep talking <laughs> <laughs> no. Keep talking you, like nothing. You didn't see nothing. <laughs> I switched the yeah, camera okay. before they saw it me blow an, up. It is an interesting question because we did before we had mission giver missions only be available based on locality, but then we decided to make the invites available globally to make it more available yeah. for everyone. Yeah, it's a difficult, like it's a real difficult decision to make. Uh, that um, so, what we want. Um, these missions to do because they're so special we think like compared with the others uh, is like a player would maybe want to travel some distance and maybe that's the impetus for them moving from Crusader to Hurston you know they get a mission giver mission and um, they um, and that that makes them travel to a new location and then they have a new adventures there um, that's that's great that's a really good intention but it does mean that a lot of people... Oh, God, press F3. Press F3. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> Don't touch... Uh, a, lot, 
A lot of people. They can't see this, so that you're. you're <laughs> they can't see me messing up. You're ruining it. <laughs> <laughs> Um, a lot of people, um, a lot of people like don't want to travel. So we basically offered a mission to someone who will not play it, and that sits there for a time on them. Um, and it, someone else could be playing it. Like Jared really wanted this mission, but mm -hmm. it was on Detox, and Detox may not have wanted to play it. So we have to be very careful um, about how we do that. We are offering it, from, you know, across the solar system. So if you want to play it, you should be able to get it from anywhere in that solar system. Um, uh, whether it stays like that, we'll see. Um, but um, I mean, you can be kind and immediately uh, like decline the invite and then uh, at least freeze it up for other players if you don't want it. But obviously, you don't, we, we don't expect that. Um, yeah. We we offer the invitation there straight Very into good. the action. Look at that, seamless. Did, was, was that all hidden? Yeah, it was all hidden. One. Oh, it's a shame because the con the counter mm -hmm. mission became available and popped up on your screen during that time. Yeah, but I wasn't going to go against my friends here. <laughs> all right. Um, yeah, so... Uh, no, instantly forgot what I was talking about. Oh, yeah, yeah, how you get the mission. How you get the mission. Um, so, right now, the, if you want to get these missions, any mission from a mission giver, the best thing you can do is, or like, can it... Oh, God. I'm an excellent oh, pilot! That, that was a landing. Backwards. That was amazing. That was a um, Is, um, do other missions and complete them. Um, and if you can't complete them, don't fail them. Try just abort them for now. Um, um, because reliability is built up by completing missions oh, currently really? like um we want we want um reputation per uh, player and such uh, per mission giver and and that we don't have that currently so there's this overall look at that perfect um there's this overall reliability stat so go complete missions um, you will have a higher chance of being chosen when it comes to the random choice that they, they pick um, of, of getting that um, mission. Getting any mission, sorry. Sorry, uh, sorry to interject again. Absolute, <laughs> I, I may, may have had a technical difficulty if somebody else would like to take over the pilot seat, if they can. I cannot. Making my way back in now. So what are you the guys trying to do up there? Is locked. The I cutlass will the be locked to anyone. Great job, well done, turret gunner. So the turret gunner's taken out the turrets on the bunker, at least. So That's safe. right. Good job, Urban Nerd. <laughs> so that's another sort of thing we were talking about, wanting to be able to share the ship with the party, because currently the seat will be locked to the mission owner. Well, right. to anyone but the mission owner. Yeah, to anybody but the mission owner. Now, I'm approaching from the ground, because I'm an excellent pilot. Uh, <laughs> what can I expect here? Having never done this mission before. Um, if oh, with your look, please don't go down that lift on your own, um, <laughs> because it's going to be full of AI, and they're not usually the sharpest uh, sharpest of AI. But I, 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 I don't know. I think we've got a good chance against you. Shots <laughs> fired. <laughs> hey. Shots fired. <laughs> I was really good at Quake I, 3 Team I Arena. I dare you to go down that list. <laughs> go on, you're right. Go you. on, you're right. I was also very good at Quake. Yeah, Quake 3 Team Arena and Tribes 2. I was really good back in those days. Sure, I haven't played an oh, FPS Team since. Fortress. So, so Detox, he's just following your ship. Are you going anywhere near it right now? Oh, yeah, I'm right, right outside the bunker, but I don't want to park too close in case uh, we get more trouble. So I'm going to park behind this rock. Okay. Oh, we can't see you. Yeah, I lost you when you went down. Okay. You Are you going to do the sneaky press F3 and, and levitate? Can you see me now? Where are you? Where are you? I see my gladius. Right. There you are. Yeah. Right. There we go. All right. Go ahead. Excellent. Okay, we'll, we'll be your beacon. Go we will await your arrival. I'll go ahead and land. It's fine. Okay. Let's be his bacon. Maybe I could have parked a little closer, but I didn't, I didn't want to alert the bad guys to my presence. Well, it shows exactly. off this, the, the true scale of yep. the game. Yep. What took a few seconds in the ship will take 
Monkey. Monkey. Like, I mean, Which is always a, a difficulty for us. It is a difficulty for us. Like, the difference between the speed of a ship and, you know, um, like we, we'd have to build uh, space stations like two kilometers long. Uh, and it still takes you like 0.5 of a right. second to fly past it. Yeah. Uh, yet, if you get out into EVA, it seems enormous. <laughs> it's two kilometers. Yeah. It's a long way. Uh, interesting scale. So how about that uh, that counter mission? How does one get that? <laughs> oh, I, that's very easy to get, that thankfully. Uh, as long as somebody accepts this mission and gets close enough to the UGF, the underground facility, um, anyone with a positive virtue, um, so that's like mi minus 0 0.1 to 1, um, they will be offered it, um, offered the mission. It's on your right. To your right. There you go. Um, they will be offered it, and f up to four people can accept that. Yeah, I saw I saw it offered uh, on screen and on my screen as well, and yeah. on Disco's screen. It was that's the Seize and Destroy mission. Yep. Yeah. So the Seize and Destroy mission is to um, is from Blackjack Security, and they're they're the people that obviously have heard uh, about this underground facility and want the drugs taken, destroyed, so they don't uh, hit the streets. They have a local security for um, Art Corp. They're a kind of private security hired. Um, and um, you will be hired to get go in there and destroy the drugs uh, by any means possible. Yeah, it's essentially the operation that Pacheco had heard of. Yep. Um, like very soon i think we should be able to like actually spawn ai um like the security forces that are coming in as well um uh like using kind of monster closets and, and things like that but yeah. for now we um we're <laughs> um relying on players relying on players don't question my tactics tactics T turn T T will turn that flashlight off too. <laughs> Shh. So Gareth fixed a nice bug a little while ago here, which was um, the turrets used to respawn the moment you went over like <laughs> 800 meters away. Because um, what, what was the reason? Uh, it's my fault. <laughs> no reason other than my fault. It, it uh, linked linked. Um, it to the wrong action area so there's a huge action area around this whole thing like so you don't see the facilities pretty much if you go too far away and if you go that far away it's kind of expected that you're on you know you're out of there you're not going to come back again um so that's the one that uh, we use now and we should have been using for the um yes uh, hey, for respawning hey, I was things gonna, I was gonna say, uh, before we go down we should reinvite the party so i get my party markers back it's all right it's a long That'll be lift. fantastic, yeah. If I shoot you a preemptive, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, we're going to have to be really, really careful here because none of us are really rocking any heavy armor. No. We, we are not kitted out. I hear him. I can already hear the angry Brits. The angry hooligans. Careful. Make sure you don't shoot too many boxes in combat. You might get the maze. <laughs> yup. Uh, if anybody's been here before, you might notice that uh, compared to the previous version, there is now more white boxes of Altrusia toxin. One down. Can confirm. Two down. It, it's on a swivel. All that business. <laughs> Wait, we, 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 we need the fake pseudo uh, Serpentine. team chat. Serpentine maneuvers. Uh... <laughs> God, what was that? I'm trying to remember the lines from the Gamescom 2015 demo. It's possible I This blocked. is actually quite terrifying to watch because I, I just think there's going to be one bullet, one stray bullet that catches him in the head. Got him. <laughs> <laughs> this is going well so far. May have just jinxed it. Hey, you're doing okay. Down. You're down or they're down? No, they're down, sorry. <laughs> Is that two or three more, perhaps? 
I have an A as well. I have uh, one A. I haven't killed anybody, so I'm just gonna yeah. charge in. See what happens. All right, I'm on your. I'm right in front of you. One Liffy. Nope. It's obvious they heard I was coming and they're afraid. Nerd, I'm. Uh, are you in the server yeah. room? Yeah. Yep. It's on your side. First room's clear. Possibly all tangos down then. Yep, all clear. I got him. Um, yes. <laughs> so right. detox. Explain. Part. Yeah, explain to uh, Jared what he's looking for, and then leave him to it. <laughs> yep. We've yeah, only got ten so minutes left in the show, so. All oh, right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> You're looking for the barker brown wood chips. <laughs> okay. It's like a brown wood out. chippy <laughs> substance. It's like bran flakes on steroids. And that was kind of my first thing when I tried this mission was, what, these? what, what the heck do I look like? Smiley faces. Smiley faces. Big bags of smiley faces. Oh, that's a neon. What? That is um, ecstasy, I guess. Uh, MS World. Oh, wait, this is ecstasy? All right, I got mine. Yeah. Yep. There you go. <laughs> he's, off, he's off night <laughs> to the nightclub. <laughs> Going back to G-Lo. The cool thing about this mission, though, Luke, is that you can collect all of these drugs, can't you, if you want to? If you have that kind of patience, and I've seen <laughs> that you do, yes. yes. You also run the risk of the people there to destroy them. Yeah, arriving. so the, the longer you take, um, the more chance, yeah, that you get shot in the back, or that you load up your, your the lift full of um, all of these drugs, and the, the person whose job it is to come here and destroy them presses the button and gets delivered to him. Exactly <laughs> what he was All of your for. And they get annihilated. Have, did you have get the package? Ah, I got okay. it. Has, um, has the, has the bark mulch. So I don't I think mean, he has. I think it's red. That one looks quite red to me. I think we're looking for a, it's a darker brown kind of color, I believe. I definitely no, don't I think, know. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa, whoa. Show and tell has Who's it? The lift, yeah. lift up. The other thing is. Um, I think I need to, because I have the mission, I think I need to pick it up in order yep. for the mission to progress. Is that yeah, correct? I'm gonna that it. is correct. Right. Uh, yeah, that is so, correct, yeah. yeah. Oh. Uh, I'm still looking for it, actually. That's right. Detox. Um, I'm right here, back. Detox. Back here. Is back here. No party I was holding it. I lost everybody. Beautiful. Thank you. There you go. Okay, hopefully this still works. You pick it up here. Um, yep. Okay. Who actually sent that lift up? Because, as I say, there could be someone coming in behind you. Is there <laughs> other people? Oh, hold on. Oh, on a private Ooh. server? I might get to... Might get <laughs> that to lift went up for me Zyla? yesterday. Uh, Is right. it Zyla? Logging in? I, I may have hit the... Uh, I would not put it behind... beyond anybody that I work with to screw with me during a show. Especially <laughs> if you watch the hosting for Inside Star Citizen just yesterday. Seems to be a hobby in this okay. place to... Alright, I'm lost. <laughs> All right, going down. Go demo stairs. We gotta rescue him. Call the rescue there, rangers. There we are. Here we are. Okay, here we are. Get him out of there. Okay. Oh, <laughs> that directions. <laughs> well, I, I got here and then I went looking for you guys and then I got lost. Wait, let me let me see the bark. Is this what we're looking for? Yeah, let's totally. shoot it. Don't shoot it. Yes, that's a. All right, guys, be ready for uh, contact on the surface. Oh, I'm well, maybe I should hold the stuff then. Oh, you gotta hold the stuff. He, I gotta hold it. Yeah, that's right. Otherwise, protect the package, people. Oh god, just don't knock me off the elevator. Clear. Okay. Now this is the tricky part. I don't see any contact. Find out the here. again. I am. Uh, I am with the package. He can't run holding it. Okay, I don't see the marker for the cutlass, so I'm just following you. Straight into the sun. Is there any danger of me breathing in this substance, Luke? Um, <laughs> not now, but very soon, we hope. We're getting, yeah. putting in the um, player... What do we call the actor it? status system. system. Yeah, the status system. So, uh, so basically... 
Um, I don't know if you've ever read any of the effects these drugs have on you, but it would be really interesting to see, um, like, if you're firing at um, AI and they're taking cover behind these things, cause, uh, taking cover behind dynamic objects is what the AI guys are going to be working on as well. Um, and you manage to clip a slam, which is the blue uh, crystal thing. That will enrage them and make them like uh, be able to just take bullet after bullet as they run towards wow. you. Yeah, to, I think like, Mad Max. You to death. <laughs> uh, um, uh, whereas you know, if you hit the the E Tam, maybe they'll just get very very mellow, very chilled. Find the vending machine. Yeah, I was talk <laughs> talking to Todd about that. It's 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 we it's going to be. I mean, obviously, no no guarantee, but something we definitely want to want to work towards is that actor staticism so when you start blowing up the, the the drugs if you're not wearing a helmet you know you you could fall under the the effects of those drugs and maybe even you know some of the drugs don't aren't filtered by the filtration system so maybe even if you're wearing a helmet it might still get get through so yeah i'm i'm crossing my fingers and hoping for that like it's not lethal doses coming in but you did just blow up a you know right a right. half a meter cube of <laughs> Yeah, had to let them know we're leaving. All right, who, so who's flying? <laughs> I would volunteer. Okay, the but... drugs secure. No. Um, they are uh, out. It's locked. Yep. Yeah, I got to take the pilot seat again. Don't worry, the hotel is is back in action. Oh, don't point at it. <laughs> oh, we, we've got four minutes to get there. Otherwise, <laughs> Jared shoots the drugs. <laughs> <laughs> I do like uh, when I've seen other people play this mission. I, I do like uh, one of the th my favorite things I saw was uh, one group had a mission, and then the other counter mission group came in, and they fought for a while, and then they managed to uh, come to a truce and just start loading up every drug in the place. Like they fought for a second, and, they, and then it occurred to them that they might make more money if they just collectively stole everything in the in the outpost <laughs> and, and took <laughs> it back to, awesome. to sell. Uh, I, I don't know if the money actually worked out. It, they, were, they were taking, it took, it, it takes quite a bit to load up everything that's in that place. So I, I, oh, I wasn't able to stick it's around. It's definitely, definitely worth your time if you know what to pick up and where to sell them. Um, it's not worth your time if you uh, don't know what to pick up but that way or where to sell the, the best place to sell them um i what well, the, the thing i like about watching people do this is how how neatly they uh stack everything and how it's yes. always it's top it's, yeah, it's, it's always so in smart. an order it's like okay all the blue stuff goes over here <laughs> they sort it on the deck goes over it's so neat my wallpaper at work for a while was a picture of somebody in the cut list with just very neat piles and boxes on my know. desktop. I was like, that's so cool. All of our players like, are so OCD <laughs> with, like, like, not just tossing them in. They just want to get the most in yeah. they can, don't they? Well, you can't cross-contaminate. Devalue the, the cargo. Yeah. Alright. So, we're yeah, obviously... We jump. <laughs> we're, 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 we're about at the end of our, uh, of our time here. Um, but yeah, is there any is there anything more, Luke Gareth? You you you'd like our uh, our community to know about this mission in particular, or just mission design in general? Um, I don't know. I mean, I'd love to be able to see. I mean, I've not got the chat up now. Like, so I don't want to give too much away, but I, I'd love to know if uh, <laughs> anyone had figured out like a quick way of um, destroying these drugs because we we did. We added the little thing. Um, really? the, We've been in, really? in, in the underground the end of the facility. Grain. Yeah, and and we just wondered if anyone had like kind of figured out oh. why. Oh. Is there any questions in the chat? That we have one minute to answer. Mm. <laughs> Detox, you hit that self destruct, right? <laughs> I wish. It was not <laughs> destroy his maze. Warned. Destroy his. Oh, is it gone? It's oh, gone. It disappeared. Ah, oh, disappeared. Mute me. I was going to jump off with the thing. All right, guys. <laughs> uh, Detox, Damn. Uber Nerd, Nerd Show and Tell, thank you so much for taking time uh, to, be here, for to be here with us today. 
been a lot of fun. Thank you for having us, man. Yep. Can I just say that my hotess was not plugged in when we left the hangar, so uh -huh. don't judge my pony. <laughs> Thank you very much. We're all judging you, you know. <laughs> <Yeah. that. laughs> and of course, uh, if, if you want to, if you want to drop the links to your your, your channel in the chat, uh, so folks can can check your streams out. Uh, they're uh, they're they're all they're all uh, very entertaining and interesting uh, uh, streamers that I've enjoyed watching for some time. Actually, I, I will be honest and tell you, I, I recent I only recently discovered Nerd Show and Tell, and uh, if if you need any reason to watch him at all, uh, just look at his setup. His tech setup makes makes me envious. Um, well, thank you, <laughs> Luke Gareth. Thank you so much again, especially on a Friday, for taking time at the end of your week to be here on the show with us. It's it's always. Uh, yeah, this yeah, is the end of our week. <laughs> Brutus and Con tomorrow. Oh, this that's right. Are, lovely, are you going? To, are to are you going to Brutus and Con? Yep. Yeah, and uh, going out to uh, the pub today. What's it called? Gotcha. Uh, uh, bar uh, citizen. Yeah. You just reminded me. You just reminded me. Uh, uh, Tyler wanted me to, to 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 give a shout out. There are a ton of bar citizens uh, happening this week, and not just Brutus and Con. But if you're in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, Columbus, Ohio, San Antonio, Texas, uh, Northwest, and Central Arkansas. Arkansas has got two different ones going on this weekend. Uh, Santa Clara, California, uh, Bordeaux, France, Sandy, Utah. That seems like a, uh, like a redundancy. Uh, Toronto, Ontario, Canada, San Diego, California, and Houston, Texas all have bar citizens going on this weekend. So if you're in any of those areas and you've never been to one or you're just looking for another one to go to, uh, you can check out uh, barcitizen.sc and find out all the specific uh, events and details on um, where to do that. Uh, That's Luke, amazing. Yeah, I don't know why this weekend was such a big one, but uh, it is. So, uh, Luke, Gareth. And I'll be at all of them. <laughs> Well, you're going to Britain, right? <laughs> All right. Uh, thank you so much, guys. Uh, that's it. We'll wrap up. Um, that's all I got. Thanks for watching uh, uh, Star Citizen Live, everybody. We'll, we'll see you next week. Say goodbye, everybody. Bye. Ciao. Yeah. Thanks, guys. See, see you around the bus. Yep. See you out there. Thanks for watching. For the latest and greatest in Star Citizen and Squadron 42, you can subscribe to our channel or you can check out some of the other shows. And you can also head to our website at www.robertsspaceindustries.com. Thank you very much for watching.